remember what we did last time? Wait a minute. Jesus! Shut up, Excuse me? You're so fucking lucky that I can't punch you. It's telling me you cannot do that now. Oh my god, that actually scared me. I did not expect that dude to just scream. Oh god. Get up, you drunk lady. Oh, why is there so many people? Oh god. This place is popping. Where the white women at? Ah, uh, here already. Come on, let's find some arse rests. Should start soon. Some arse rests. <laughs> that's, a, that's a unique name for a chair. Well, we got real quiet. Shit, are we about to watch a... What are we about to watch? song oh they were crying shit I didn't know it was that emotional 
Oh, that's how, is that how you wipe away tears like this? Shit, my bad. I guess I should have respected her. My bad. <laughs> She's got two different colored legs. What a weirdo. Uh oh. I know him. Twas he murdered some Tamarian boys back at White Orchard. Silence, woman. We've come to hear music. Yeah, silence. A murderer? There's a war on. Some die. Oh, please, argue this out elsewhere. Squabbles and rows again. And I was told this was a decent establishment. If I know Geralt, he risked his noggin to save someone else's ass. Save, you say? He murdered folk. Don't let him provoke you. There's the door. Settle this outside. Ooh. What up, girl? Ooh, I'm coming. I wish to listen to music. Fuck off, you old bitch. I'm just kidding. That's me. I'm sure she's a nice lady. She, I did murder someone in her inn. I think she's the innkeeper of White Orchard, isn't she? She looks familiar. My bad. Permit me to introduce uh, Alessia's Priscilla, known also as Calanetta. As lovely as she is talented. And this. Is Geralt of Rivia, I know. Dandelion's told me a great deal about you, and I've listened with bated breath. Don't be surprised. After all, doubt I could think of a more fitting subject for a ballad than a witch's love for a sorceress. Or should I say, sorceresses. What? I like them. Bards, not people I can fight in. There's a good reason I don't pour my heart out to bards. They always babble, as you just demonstrated. But listen. Besides giving you the details of my affairs, did Dandelion mention his own plans, where he might be going? <laughs> Splendid. Very funny, truly. So, see you later. Not here. Come with me. Oh, oh. oh. We're getting the secret intel. There a reason for all this sneaking around? An excellent one. When last I saw Dandelion, he told me he was planning a heist. Siggy Reuven's vault? Shoot up. And I've not seen him since. Taking the heist was a bust? Let me guess. Attempted heist was a failure. Well, he's not driven up in a gilded carriage laden with jewels, so I should think so. I've asked after him everywhere. But it seems an army of tongue-stealing cats has overrun the city. I learned only that he raised a ruckus at Horson Jr.'s lair. Then Horson's men chased him all over town. Horson Jr. doesn't ring a bell. Biggest prick in Novigrad. Not literally, but... Got it. You're not a fan. But what did he do to you? Try the whole town. He's one of four bosses who control the city's underworld. The others being Siggy Rubin, Carlo the Cleaver Vares, and the King of Beggars. The rascal. At least they didn't cross the church as well. Bring that venerable institution into it. And be in deep then. Looks like I gotta rescue Dandelion. Again. Here I go again, rushing to Dandelion's rescue. He ought to pay me a salary. Wherever he is, I sincerely doubt he's in the mood for jokes. Nor am I, in fact. Relax, I'll get him out of this. Gotta talk to this Horson first. And Siggy Reuven. Know where I might find them? I don't know about Horson, but Reuven runs a bathhouse. Careful, though. He's a dangerous character. So am I. <laughs> Hell yeah, we are. The Dandelion's not. I beg you to hurry up. Let me know as soon as you learn anything. Sure, she's like, she's like, Bugger really, old. really upset that he's gone. Heading back to the road. Dandelion. She's like, no, my Dandelonians. How are my pantalones supposed to get wet if my Dandelonies not here? Level 13, boys. That was quick. Goddamn. That's all I had to do. All right. Um, let's see. <laughs> Could max that out. Increases the chance of landing a fast attack critical hit by 2%. And fast attack critical hit damage by 15%. And upgrade that. We gotta get in a slot. I'm becoming a little badass, boys. Alright, what up, Kurt? How you doing, bud? Yes? Count 
her dice art. Are you here regarding the combat? Oh. Wanted to hire a witcher, didn't you? I did, but not just any vagabond. One hears all manner of stories about the lunatics of the school of the cat. Which do you belong to? School of the wolf, not your concern. School of the griffin. Uh, I have no idea. School of the wolf. School of the wolf. Ah, yeah. A good one. I knew a witcher of this school. Barnabas? Uh, no. His name did begin with a B. Never mind. Uh, to the matter at hand. Not long past, I acquired an estate east of Novigrad. I got it on the cheap, you see. The seller was very keen to be rid of it. Now, I've learned, the building is set to be haunted. Goes to explain the seller's urgency. I do not believe in ghosts. It is that simple. But my men say the house shakes at night. Walls crumble. Why, even the floors move about. Is there anything to be done? A remedy for this? Let's talk about my reward. Let's talk about my reward first. I beg your pardon? Asking for coin already, but you've not done the job. Need to make sure it's worth my time. Just look at that. Arrives in Navigrad and he's off his head in minutes. Very well. How much do you believe this should cost me? Uh, I'm gonna go 320 gold. Hmm. No. I'm afraid that's too much. But okay. we're near a price I would consider reasonable. What do you what do you So 320 you don't like? Alright, I'll take 300. Yes. Agreed. Thank you. I'll tend to it. Fine. I'm willing to investigate. How do I get there? An orchard adjoins the property. The house itself you should recognize easily. Cracks cover its walls. Is the key. And good luck. What the hell does he want me to fight? Go to oh, okay, this is a different one. Contract. Door slamming shut. I wanna see. I wanna see what this quest is. Oh, it's a it's a Witcher contract. Uh door Oh my god, level 24! Travel to the haunted house mansion! I'm definitely not ready for that. Hell no. Hell no. We'll get we'll do this get Junior on. Go to the bathhouse and talk to Siggy Rubin. On my way. Dude, the tunes are, are popping. Hello, Rich Town. Hello. Hello. How do you know that one's rich? This guy, this guy's rich, but he apparently doesn't give a shit about his fingers. You cut those bad boys off. <laughs> hey, where's that lady that said I was a murderer? Cause I'm gonna. Down. Oh. I'm gonna touch her. Not in a weird way. Mine. Now you. Oh. Well, hello. Oh, no, I'm good. Uh, I'm good. Well, Y'all are not great. Notice board. There's something on the notice board. What do we got? Whoa, my man, I didn't mean to fight you. Beware, haunted house and, and cheating merchants? New quest, haunted house. Wait, is this the same one? Visit the haunted house again? While strolling the bustling streets of Novigrad, girl came across a most intriguing notice. It suggests the, the man named D. Junkier has sold some poor fool the house, which Sarah, the lovable, that's right, Sarah the godling was in it. The notice made it clear the new owner was not amused by his unwanted tenant's pranks. Geralt decided to check up on Sarah and see how she was doing. Oh, dude, I'm kind of down to do this little side mission really quick. Hey, you! Yes, you. Hey, yeah, no. I don't know what you said, sir. I really don't want to talk to you right now. I'm going to check out this haunted house where the godling lived. I thought we got rid of the god. Oh, no, that's right. We ended up just giving her the house. We said it was haunted. We were a nice guy to her. There's so many drunk beggars and shit around here. Hello. You wanted me. But I didn't want my hair pulled. Can't have one without the other. Then I don't want them. Hello? Witcher? Witcher? What up, little godling? Kareem, look who's come. Huh. Live here together now. Didn't know. 
Once you told me Sarah had been responsible for my nightmares, I decided to see if the devil was as scary as they paint him, or her. I came in to find not a fiend, but our little Sarah. And I can't say why, but we took a liking to one another immediately. This lady's pretty hot. Long ago, to isolate themselves from a world of beasts, humans began building cities. But scene? since beasts prowl within stone walls as well as they do outside them, this did not allay human fears. The truth is, walls guarantee no one's safety. The place where you lock yourself in and lock all else out, that's not your home. Your home is sometimes a place you travel long and far to find. What? Whoa, Sarah, man, she little fucker just punched me. Boo! Scare you. Boo. Mmm. Damn, bro, what's your name? Yes. Hey, I know you're into weird shit and like you and this godly are like best friends, but I mean, I, I, I'm single. I mean, in the game, not in real life, but. Yes. And your name almost yes. looks like Titty. It's kind of funny. Okay. Anyways, have. Wait, what the hell is that giggle? Alright, I'm just gonna let them do their weird things. Goodbye. That was a weird little quest. Alright, go to the bathhouse. How far away is that? 168 meters. Not that far. Yeah, this is the second stream of the day, guys. I, I did a stream earlier. We, we played, uh, we were part of that PUBG, that $100,000 PUBG tournament. We came in fifth. And I uh, shared for like almost, I think it was like four and a half, five hours. Leave me, please. The hell? You leave that little girl be, you freak. But uh, we uh, we streamed for like five hours, and then I, I shut down the stream, and I've, I've restarted so we could do some Witcher 3 Wednesday. <gasps> Yikes. That almost, I, dude, I thought I was going to die. The bathhouse is right here. Anybody there? Open up. To the owner, I know he's here. I'm not sure that matters as he's terribly busy. Don't care. Tell him Geralt of Rivia wants to talk to him. I cannot promise Mr. Ruben that we'll have time to see you. Wanna bet? <laughs> Very well, I shall try. Please wait. Hey, why did he why did he do that? Why did he laugh like that? That's so creepy. Oh God! Sigurd like Ruben that. cordially invites you to join him. I'm Happen. Your name's Happen. The meeting is in the baths. We will pass through the dressing room so you can leave your clothes. Let's go. They want me butt ass naked. What kind of meeting is this? You make this robe here. Your equipment will be safe. I, I don't really believe you. Wait, where? Alright. Oh, what you up, girl? You guys looking to get a bath? He doesn't blush. You need a rest? Meets to yourself. Oh my bad. You guys have just been going all day, huh? Oh my god, look at so, You're a lout. Lout. Just a bit. What up, girl? Jackass. What is that? Greetings, handsome. Greetings. Greetings. Well, I might as well get all this. I mean, we can't just, can't just leave all this stuff behind. Those are all bodyguards. All these bodyguards look the same, and they're all getting their DW. Yes. He 
easy, Cleaver. All son Junior's a dead man. I'll have my scribe send you a notice. You don't have a scribe. And we'll eliminate Junior when, and only when, all of us say aye. Aye. Reuven, your guest. So many scars. So Why the many. fuck you let him in here? Because I want to talk to him. This is Geralt of Rivia. Good to see you again. As always, I'm out of the swiping loop. Who the fuck are you? None of your business. Think I'll let your host introduce me. He's a witcher. The very one who first foiled an attempt on Foltest's life, and then killed that body. Allegedly. But I didn't kill Foltest. And hello to you too, Dijkstra. Dijkstra! Whatever they call you these days. Last we met, Geralt thrashed me silly and crushed my anchor. I really wonder what he's got in store this time. Got intruders. Someone just snuck inside the bathhouse. Several men. What the fuck's he on about? Plowing fortune teller. Assassins! Please, no! Ah! Jesus! Bloody hell. I fucking knew it. Any weapons tucked away? Just a few. Oh, let's go! About to beat some ass in my towel. Maybe you just drop the towel, start slapping your meat around, you know? Just kind of like that. With my prick hanging out. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> All right, let's do this. What up, motherfuckers? Oh, shit. Bro, you can't handle the truth. <laughs> Woo! Who's next? Oh my god, I'm crushing these dudes. You did. That's all of them! I got your back, Blue! Oh god, Good nice dwarf ass. Jess. Terribly sorry for that incident. My security failed. I'll get to the bottom of who, why, and how. There are they were them. awesome scum. That's the bottom of who and how right there. Don't start that again. Especially not in front of our guest. Dude, Geralt is Who pranced in right before they attacked. Coincidence? Why do I doubt Probably followed it? me. Let's give him a chance to explain. I'm looking for Horson Jr. Interesting. What do you want with him? Junior's gonna help me find someone. Horson's not helped a soul in all his miserable life. I'm gonna for I'll this ask man. Him nicely. That dude has tattoos See, of naked Cleaver. women on his Perhaps if stomach you'd not and chest. Junior, an uncle fucker, and asked him nicely. Uncle if fucker. He up today. Gentlemen, you out of your fucking minds. A chat session. Poor son's out to get us, and he'll succeed eventually. We've got to kill him first. So, by all means, you sit here, soak, fart, and watch the bubbles rise, while I send my boys to Poor son's hidey holes. They'll make some noise, flush the bugger out. <laughs> And you, geriatric, or whatever your plowing name is, geriatric. Wanna find all, son. Find me first. I already found you. You're literally standing in front of me, you little weirdo. So, where will I find Junior? Hope I find Junior before Cleaver does. Any clue on Junior's whereabouts? Be grateful for any lead. Siggy, it's worth a try. Geralt's got a knack for finding people, and he's discreet, a value in itself. Leave you to it then. I'll uh, look in on you tomorrow, Francis. Finish our talk. So how about we get dressed? Sure, sure. Then we'll talk. 
in private. Right mess that was. Never thought I'd be glad to see the man responsible for my taking frequent baths. If you're any cleaner for it, gotta say it was worth breaking your ankle. It healed poorly. Can you believe it? I must soak it in hot water at least six times a day now. Failing that, it bloody pounds like the bells of Beauclair at dawn. Uh, I had my reasons. I had my reasons. Your leg would be fine if you hadn't gotten in my way. I see. Well, I promise you that if I could go back in time, I'd do things quite differently on Thanet. For example, I'd have my men kill you instead of just tying you up. Listen, Reuben. No, Damn. Dijkstra. Just Dijkstra. not your code names, passwords, and other bullshit. I'm here on specific business. If you want to listen, listen. If not, I'd rather you spared me your wit and threw me out now. Ah, uh, what's the harm? Talk. You think Cleaver will find Orson? He might. He might not. But he'll burn down half the city trying. What waste. Leave him to it, I say. Work alone. Any ideas? Junior's got areas of the city where he's strong. Penetrate them. Penetrate. Them, but be discreet. None of this speed and fury and swinging your steel cock about. Nah, Dave, I haven't played any Gwent. I just, I know I'll get sucked into it and then I'll spend like 40 minutes playing Gwent and I want to play the game. Horson, what's, uh, what's he on? Where's he strong? Hmm. Makes sense to ask around, I guess. Junior might be in hiding, but he's got to be collecting income. Couldn't afford to cut himself off. Gambling. That's his big earner. Junior controls the largest casino in town. I'll never forget. Hierarch Hemelfart raised all kinds of hallowed hell there once. Hierarch the Camelfart? Oh, Hemelfart. <laughs> then there's the arena in the, the last city's name? bowels. Hemelfart or Betting scheme generates near as much as the casino. They're always looking for hired muscle there. Suppose you could always search Horson's house. Though I doubt you'll find him there. Maybe some clue, though. All right, where's the casino? Where's Junior's casino? Near the Temple Watch Towers. Horson's got nought to do with a casino officially. So careful what you say. Try not to arouse any suspicions. Okay. Arena sounds promising. Where's that? Sewers beneath Gildorf. But you'll have to enter through the pits. Endure the stench of poverty on the way. Now, Junior loves a good fight. Wager he'd give a lot to see a real witcher in action. Ah, okay. Mentioned Horson's got a house. Where is it? Solid townhouse on Temple Isle, just on the other side of the bridge. Wouldn't wager me knickers on finding him there. Junior's not that stupid. Alright. See if I can't find Horson at the casino or the arena. Might talk to Cleaver as well, though. Do what you will. Just be cautious. Horson's expecting payback, I've no doubt. Thanks for your help, Dijkstra. Just go, Witcher. And if you can't find the slimy bastard, come and see me. I know him well. Might figure something out. Listen, Dandelion's missing. Any idea what might have happened to him? Same thing that happens to anyone who steps on Junior's toes. Meaning? He's surrounded by splendid virgins who ply him with sparkling wine and pastries stuffed with nightingale's tongues. Come, Garup, what do you think's happened to him? I reckon he's at the bottom of the pontar, trussed up with the strings of his old mandolin. Loot. Far as I'm concerned, he might as well be rotting down there with a goddamn trombone. Hey, chill out, Dijkstra. Seem a bit prickly. Prickly. Something bothering you. Sorry. I know I've been unbearable lately. But at my age, the menopause, what with hot flushes and violent mood swings? Dijkstra, men don't get menopause. You know that, don't you? Yes, you moron. I also know you don't actually give a shite about my problems. What do you want? You got me. Need work. Thought you might throw some my way. Monster trouble, that sort of thing. Yeah. Might be able to help me, in fact. And if you did, why then I might be inclined to ask after Dandelion. Establish what happened to him. 
Let's do it. Maybe I can help. What do you need? I'd rather show than tell. Picture's worth a thousand words in all that tribe. Ah, and you do realize, if you say anything about what you see here to anyone, it'll mean a razor between your ribs. Figured as much. Excellent. One last request. Oh, let's call it what it is. A command. Don't draw your sword unless I ask you to. I mean, but, like, I'm a witcher, and if I want to draw my sword, I will draw a sword, you know? What's he trying to do? Lure me to the the bathtub? Sicko. Oh, a little secret, little secret door, huh? Can you imagine having something like this in your house? Like an actual, like, secret passage or secret, secret so hideout, dude? One of these me. days. That'd be so goddamn cool. Damn, but you got a whole, like, leg brace. Oh, now I do kind of feel bad. Sorry, bro. Well. We found a little something something right here. Ignite that bitch. Stealing all this. Oh God. We're gonna oh, fight Bart. Him. Not again. Bart. Bart? God damn it, Bart. Bart, stop that. Now. Bart makes Ziggy lose. Corfin? Beating your head against the wall won't change that. Bart, hard. But less thinky. This thing reminds but me of my dog Sullivan so much. Thinky, but Sadler. Uh, what? Don't seem to have trouble communicating with the troll. Why'd you bring me down here? Take note of that hole. We'll come back to it later. And see that door? Vault behind it until recently filled with Novigrad crowns and countless other valuables. But God, then boom, Chorfoot go. Translating into common, someone fucking made off with nearly 20 tons of my gold and all the lighter stuff, and you will help me get it back. It was Dandelion. It's gotta be Dandelion, right? Fine, I'll help you. You're not exactly bursting with enthusiasm. Witcher mutations, they strip us of emotion. I'd be jumping for joy otherwise. All right. Ought to look around. But first, some questions. On all ears. Nah, you're kind of all nose and chin. Take it the thieves got in through the hole behind you. You're a regular fucking master sleuth. Any other brilliant deductions you want confirmed? The year, maybe? Bloody name of Redania's king? No. But I am wondering, for instance, how that hole got there. Hole, oh, no. Boom. Hole. Bad look won't go. Bad look, no. Only sleep. Bad shrooms. Head fall. You're doing shrooms? Well, no wonder. Bad mushrooms? What's that about? Pops mold. The spores are highly toxic. One whiff and you're dead. Unless you're a troll, that is. Yes. But. But. Troll. <laughs> Not talking to you, dimwit. Where was I? Ah, mold spores. They cover the walls of the sewers other side of the vault. Actually thought it was a good thing, you know? A bit of extra protection. Thieves found a way through it. Bart, you see them? Bart, you hole. Once see, boom, got what? Breathe, shroom. Sleep, go. Jorfun, gone. Bart, troll. Oh, I kind of feel bad for Bart. Now, now, stiff up a lip. 
Boom. Can you elaborate? Boom. Boom. Oh, he got some nasty ass little nipples. This like. I'll elaborate. Explosion, big enough to blow that fucking hole in the wall, separating the vault from the sewers. Gotten pretty good at communicating with this troll. Lots of prior experience, worked with idiots my whole life. <laughs> I actually really like this guy. Try to track down the thief yourself? Of course. Hired this lummox fonts, thick enough not to ask questions. We knocked back some pops antidote and entered the sewers. Soon after, I returned alone. What happened? Lad started belching something horrendous. I mean, burps with so much mass, the walls shook. Told him, Fonz, stop. You're in the presence of a count. Well, former count, but still. And then he puked up. Up came most of the antidote. Lost his protection. Tried to pull him out. Then I heard a bubbling. Something crawled out of the water. I value the lives of my men, I do. But I value my own even more. Dropped fonts and ran like hell. Alright, gotta look around the sewers. Should look around the sewers. Got any more of that Pops antidote? Have a few vials left. Got the formula too. Disgusting swill, to be honest. But it'll save your life. Here. Thanks. Pops You're not to thank me for, literally. You're no good to me if you suffocate. Listen, I'll be upstairs if you need me. Sight of this empty vault's giving me an ulcer. Good luck to you. Dude, I'd be so upset. Man got jacked. But you know, you know it had to have been Dandelion who stole it all, right? Like he, there was a heist and then all of a sudden this dude's gold is missing? Like there's only one explanation. It's gotta be. Uh, what was I gonna do? Oh, that's right. Oh, here. Alchemy, uh, potions. What was it called? Was it an oil? No. What was it called? I guess it doesn't matter. He gave me, he did give me the, uh, is it one of these? Golden Oriole, grants immunity to poisons, ne neutralizes the effects of poisons already in the bloodstream. Oh, so it just, it just cuts, if, there, if you're poisoned at all, boom, neutralizes all the poison effects. That's pretty damn good. It's actually really good. Increases your breath supply while underwater by 50% and improves the vision while diving. Accelerates the generation of adrenaline point adrenaline points and immediately restores a portion of vitality. Oh, God. That would be huge. What the hell is a necker? Yo, pin that. Formula diagram will now appear in shop panel. Okay. Yeah, you know it's in my inventory, but... Ooh, what's this? Griffin, Foglet, Enhanced Thunderbolt, Blizzard, Cat, White Honey. And these are all just oils. What the hell is this potion? Taking damage raises damage resistance up to an upper limit for the remainder of the fight. Griffin. Hmm. Increases the sign intensity during cloudy weather. Key to an abandoned house. Should actually go. I don't see it. It's not here. Ah, here it is. Pop mold antidote grants temporary immunity to pop mold. Ah, I see. It's already in me slot. That's not what I'm doing. What edges curled out and yourself into the inside blew it wide open. Wall two. Okay. Seem to converge here. Hmm. All right, it's on my arm. Button. Edges curled out. All right, Something investigate the side of the break in using your open. Witcher senses. Wall two. Path house drain pipes seem to converge here. of paper and there's mortar on the bars so it was in place at the time of the explosion 
Glass tore it from the wall. No traces of magic. This was no spell. It was a bomb. Shouldn't go any further without taking that antidote of it. Okay, do not go any further without taking the antidote. It's a pipe clear over here. Must have been one powerful blast. Hmm. Uh, I thought witcher's potions were vile. <laughs> Fine grading. Couldn't push much through that. Okay, follow the current. I mean, I want to, but I also want to make sure I don't miss anything. Oh god, we got drowners. Come here, drowner bitches. Oh, I'm in a hole. Oh, come on. You want somersaults? Come here, drowner fucks. Come on! Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, that's okay. Just trying to eat some food. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This hole is going to be a death trap. Okay. So we follow this. Damn it, I think I, I wasted one of these potions. Oh, who the fuck's this guy? Dick's tired. Oh shit, he died right here. Loot his ass. He's got nothing. The hell is loot? What are lunar shards used for? Anyone else? Must be one of Dandelion's crew. Ah, Vomit everywhere. Guess he has the antidote too. Keep it down. Use your Witcher senses to search the sewer room for evidence. made that jump. I thought for sure I was going to die right there. Oh, give me all the dwarven spirits. Says to search for evidence in here. Oh, I didn't even see that. Hmm. Bottom of a container. Silver cylinder, most likely. Runes etched in the bottom. It's warped, probably by the explosion. Bomb part. Must be. Smells like wyvern oil and caramel. Bitch, you can make a bomb with caramel? That'd be it down here. Time to see Deekstra. Return to the bathhouse. Still got our antidote still on, good. Come here, you little troll. Hey, Bart, got a minute? Maybe Bart Bindi. has some more info. Bart, no minute, Scott. Bart rock, Scott. Rocks, oh, Bar, rocks? I don't want any goddamn rocks. I mean, a minute to talk. You mean, but nice. One more time, can we talk? 
Ziggy you like. Talk me with. Anything suspicious happened before the robbery? Subsicious. Subsicious. But no understand. Something not normal. Something strange. Maybe you saw, felt, heard something? Yeah. Yeah. But here. Uh, like uh, a piece. His. <laughs> what kind of hissing was it? Like a snake? Probably a bomb. No. A piece. It's probably. Order. Not animal all that. Like the hiss of right. like a fuse. So, like what? Like. Uh, rock? Like a hissing rock. Mm -hmm. A hiss. It's a bomb. The hissing. Where did it come from? But. His here. In that tree. What? Where. Where. But. Turned it on. Will you take a dump? All right. Let's change the subject. Good. But time go. Chorfun go. But God, now nothing. Okay. Why do you like Siggy so much? Siggy good. Siggy can't take part. He locked you up, alone, underground. Don't get bored down here. Not much to do. When, but, not much do. But, think. Lots. Don't, uh, no, don't much look like a thinker. Didn't take you for a thinker. But, thinker, no. But, troll. I like Bart, man. Uh, thanks for your help. So long. Mm. Long. 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 All right, Bart. Chill out, bro. Don't hurt yourself. Whoa, whoa there, Bart. Whoa. Bart, I'll tickle you. I'll tickle you real good, Bart. <laughs>